Hello, Robert. Good morning, Robert. How are you, Robert? Good morning. Good morning, Robert. How are you? Fine? Yes, I'm, I'm fine. I'm starting this new day. <laughs> <laughs> Excellent, Robert. Activities. Good. Very good. Okay, okay. So, Robert, what about last weekend? How was last the last uh, long weekend for you? I think... Uh, mm, it was a heavy, uh, a heavy day because, well, a heavy week oh, because yes. I have to deliver some products. They call it a minimum variable product for all clients. Right. All right, all and right. also some certifications. Okay, um, okay, okay, okay. Some certifications that I have to to do. And the deadline is next December. Oh, okay. next December is the, is the so we are Very, so in a rush because we are running rush. out of time. Yes. Ah, okay, okay. So, so were you working Saturday and Sunday? No. No, no, but I have to complete the courses on sunday ah, uh, okay. just for two hours and on saturday where i take another two or three hours so you progress on the attending the courses because they are uh, self-paced so you have to attend it uh, ah. as as much as you can when you are available when you are ah. at your time Ah, okay, okay, yes, 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 okay, okay, yes, yes, yes. Uh, like you said, self organized, okay. Ah, okay, Robert, good. Robert, so you didn't go out, Robert? No, it, it was not work, but I was connected anyway, attending this ah, course. Okay, okay. Because you have to Robert, log in the have... platform. Ah, okay, okay. Robert, and, and you have a chance to go to the cinema, got to go to the mall. <clears throat> something like that no the, the, this uh, weekend no i just okay. have uh, okay okay uh, enjoying the Sorry. the weekend have some, having some rest very good okay when i i went out to the to the mall the supermarket but i noticed that it was very crowded this weekend okay 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 ah yes because it was um Exactly, because also many people enjoy the day, no? Yeah, Saturday. Yes. So no? it was very heavy going to the market. Uh, I I noticed yes. uh, a lot of people. Uh, yes, buying groceries and all the stuff that you need. Ah, so it, yes, the traffic true. jam exactly. it was heavy. Yeah, so I rather oh. stay at home. And yes, completed my courses. Very good, Robert. Robert. And what about yesterday? How are you the yesterday, Robert? I just uh, attended the course for three hours, and then I was watching uh, Netflix and YouTube and having some meals, having resting. Okay, 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 very good, okay, excellent, Robert. Good, Robert, very good, Robert. <clears throat> okay, Robert, so let's begin, okay? In the meantime, your plan is all right, Robert. Let, let's continue with our review, okay, of tenses, okay? And I prepare this, this for you and for the class, okay? All of these examples, Robert, have, um, obviously, we need to complete them, and all of them have a different tense to review. For example, I will read number one. It says, we be seeing a model tomorrow, when Bob buy this iPod, it looks new. We not watch a football game at the moment. They play hockey every afternoon. She not here from her boyfriend for three weeks. I not go to the party next Friday. Why you sing these terrible songs now? He usually go to school by bus. 
him not catch his little rabbit yet. My mother already bring us some drinks and clips for the film. They not win the game this evening. Mona and Tom play video games all afternoon last Monday. Mary's parents visit their friends now. For tomorrow, I will do no We visit the mother tomorrow. Here is, are we? Are we going to visit? Okay. Grandmother tomorrow. Exactly, very good. Okay, let's continue with number two to number 13, okay? Remember, they are different tenses, so you have to be attention to the to the sentence, okay? Very good.
Okay, I think I have it. Everyone. Excellent, Robert. Okay, well, Robert, please, number two. When? When did Bob buy this iPod? Did Bob buy? Very good. Okay. This iPod, it looks new. Very good. Okay. Robert, number three, we. Very good. Number three, we. Uh, we are not watching a football game at the moment. Very good. We are watching a football game at the moment. Very good. Number four, Robert. They. They are playing hockey every afternoon. Very good. They are playing hockey every afternoon. Very good. She. She hasn't heard from her boyfriend for three weeks. Very good. She hasn't heard her for her okay, for three weeks. Her, Very good, Robert. Her, okay. Exactly. She hasn't heard from her boyfriend for two weeks. I I will not go to the party next Friday. I will not go to Very the good. party next Friday. Exactly. I won't go to the party. Very good. Okay. Why? Why are you singing these terrible songs? Very good. Now. These terrible songs. Very good. Very good. He usually goes to school by bus very good goes to school by bus very good okay team uh, hasn't catch or hasn't catch uh, what is the past tense of catch the past participle hasn't caught hasn't caught uh, hasn't caught Remember, we gave the, the past participle and team hasn't caught very good his little rabbit, his little rabbit very good. Yes. Good. My mother. Uh, uh, my mother already brought brothers. Brought already brought us. Brought. Okay, already brought us some. Brought. Exactly. Bring brought brought bring brought brought. So many countries for the family Robert day. For the field, mm, no? they are not winning the game this evening. They, the game this evening. Okay, they aren't. They are winning they the win game this evening. This evening, very good. Mona and Tom were playing video games all afternoon last Monday. Very good. Very good. Very good. Mary's parents <clears throat> are visiting their friends, their friends now. Very good. Are we in the friends now? Excellent, Robert. Very good. Very good. Okay. Okay, Robert. So let's continue here with the book. Okay. Here is a look at this. It says the goal of today says November 5th, 2024. It says goal. By the end of the class, the student will be able to use noun phrases correctly and fluently. Okay. Let's do this activity first. It says, 
Okay, it was a missing activity. It's listening. What happened first? Okay, it's listening to each situation. Normal events from one to three. For example, number one, she got sick. Number two, she went on vacation. Number three, she went back to work. Number two, John called me. I didn't get the message. I changed phone numbers. Number thing, I was very nervous. I left the office. I felt relieved. We went out. My cousin stopped by, and I was watching the movie. Okay, why don't you listen to four conversations, Robert, and we have to order the sequence of these facts. Okay, maybe this is number one. Maybe this is number two. This is number three, or vice versa. Maybe this is one. This is two, and this is three. Okay. What I'm going to share the, this activity with you. Look, look at it. I'm going to to share it to you on, on the cloud, so you can also have it and and see them. Okay, wait a minute. Wait a minute. Okay. There it goes. Okay. Robert, and what about Robert in, in December, Robert? Do the Lloyd employees have a um, vacation or or not? Well, just the 25th, the 25th, and okay. the last week of the year. Okay. It's only okay. one one week. One week. All right, all right. Very good. Okay, okay. Very good, Robert. Very good. Very good. Very good. Okay. It will let me open it. Why? Let's see. Okay. Okay. Okay, there it goes, there it goes, there it goes. Okay. Editor. Okay. Okay, so easy, okay. So listen. Okay. There. If you click on the link, you will be able to see the activity. Okay. And I will share the the listening exercise. Okay. Okay, so I'm going to play it. Okay. Three times. Okay. There it goes. Okay. Okay. Units 3 to 4, progress check. Page 29, exercise 4, listening. What happened first? Listen to each situation. Number the events from 1 to 3. 1. Even though she had gotten sick while she was on vacation, she went back to work on Monday. 2. 
John called me last week, but I never got the message. I changed phone numbers. Three. I'd been really nervous about the job interview, so when I left the office, I felt relieved. Four. When my cousin stopped by, I was watching a movie. We went out for coffee to catch up when the movie was over. Units 3 to 4, Progress Check. Page 29, Exercise 4, Listening. What happened first? Listen to each situation. Number the events from 1 to 3. 1. She had gotten sick while she was on vacation. She went back to work on Monday. 2. John called me last week, but I never got the message. I changed phone numbers. 3. I'd been really nervous about the job interview, so when I left the office, I felt relieved. 4. When my cousin stopped by, I was watching a movie. We went out for coffee to catch up when the movie was over. Hello, Facebook. Good morning, Facebook. How are you? Welcome to the car, Facebook. How are you? Fine? Hello, Michael. Fine, thanks. And you? Okay, fine, too. So, Facebook, tell me, Facebook, how was, tell me, Facebook, how was the long weekend for you, Facebook? What did you do? Yeah. Um, the last weekend, um, uh, in the... The last Friday, I was a training in the Texcoco Lakes. All right. I visited <laughs> for, yeah. On Saturday, my daughter have a Halloween party, and I. All right. And I was support for the party. And some families come to the. Yeah, okay. this is a young party, no? This is the teenager party. Very good. So teenager. we need to check in and help with the activities for the party. And the Sunday only rest in the okay. in the home at, at home. Very good. So remember, we say on Sunday. Remember, we say on Saturday, no? We never say the, the Sunday or the Saturday, no. We say on Sunday, I stay at home. On Saturday, okay. I had a party. Okay. But what about yesterday? How were you there yesterday? Uh, yesterday, back to the reality. <laughs> um, I started with the, the, the I continued with my courses and so on. Meetings, that's all. <laughs> all right. Excellent, Mr. Very good. Okay. Right, so there, I share a link with you, okay? There on the chat here from the meet. It's an uh, listening okay. exercise, okay? We were doing a listening activity, so I will play it two more times, okay? And, okay, look at this, okay? Uh, look, look at this. I, I'm going to share the, this, the direction with you. Okay, wait a minute. And it's like this, okay? Okay. okay, it's this one, okay, it's from the book, it says, listen, it says, what happened first, it says, listen to its situation, number the events from one to three. For example, I will number one, it says, she got sick, she went on vacation, and she went back to work, okay? Number two, John called me, I didn't get the message, I say changed phone numbers. I was very nervous, I left the office, I felt relieved. We went out, my cousin stopped by, and I was watching a movie. So we are going to listen to four conversations, okay? And in the conversations, maybe, maybe this is an in disorder, for example. For conversation one, maybe this is number one, number two, number three. Or vice versa, maybe this is number one, number two, and number three. 
Okay, I need to play the recording twice, okay? Very good. So let, let me chase listening with you. Okay, there it goes. Okay. Units three to four, progress check. Page 29, exercise four, listening. What happened first? Listen to each situation. Number the events from one to three. One, even though she had gotten sick while she was on vacation, she went back to work on Monday. Two, John called me last week, but I never got the message. I changed phone numbers. Three. I'd been really nervous about the job interview, so when I left the office, I felt relieved. Four. When my cousin stopped by, I was watching a movie. We went out for coffee to catch up when the movie was over. Units three to four, progress check. Page 29, exercise four, listening. What happened first? Listen to each situation. Number the events from one to three. One, even though she had gotten sick while she was on vacation, she went back to work on Monday. Two, John called me last week, but I never got the message. I changed phone numbers. Three. I'd been really nervous about the job interview, so when I left the office, I felt relieved. Four. When my cousin stopped by, I was watching a movie. We went out for coffee to catch up when the movie was over. Okay, my friends, so let's see, okay, very good, I need to share the screen again, okay, and this time let's go to the board, okay, for example, it says, number one, it says she got sick, she went on vacation, and she went back to work, okay, for this one, look at this, the first action, the first activity is number one, this one, okay, oh, it's too small, okay, it's this one, okay, she went on vacation, okay, that is the first action that happened, Remember, here they, they were using the past perfect, okay? Number one, she went on vacation. Number two, this one, she got sick. Okay. And then number three, okay, she went back to work, okay? Okay. What about Robert? Number two, Robert. Which one, Robert, was the first action, Robert? Uh, John called me. That was the first action. Very good. Okay. The second one. Number two, I didn't get I didn't get the message. Very good. Exactly. That's action two. Very good. And then finally, and three, you know, I change. Because I change the phone Sorry. numbers. I change phone numbers. Very good. Okay. Okay. Very good, well, please, Francisco. Which one was the first action restaurant? Uh, when she was the interview, she was very nervous. Very the good. Number, one. Very good. Number two. And when she left the office, number two. Very good. Very good. And after that, she felt relieved. She felt relieved, relieved. Very good, okay, excellent. Relieved. Please, Robert, what about number four, Robert? Uh, my cousin stopped by. Very good, okay. And I was watching a movie. Exactly, that's number two. And number two, we, we went out. Exactly, my friends, very good. Okay, listen. Okay, so let, let's go to the book, okay? So here. Okay, we're going to start unit five, it says expanding your horizons, okay?
okay, expand your horizons. Now, this cost living in a foreign country describe cultural expectations and differences. Okay, it says, listen to people talk about moving to a foreign country. Check the concerns you think you will share. Okay, first, let's see. Okay, feel let's see for yourself. Okay, before listening, feel let's see for yourself. I'm going to say, one thing that I really miss is hanging out with my friends. Something that I will be worried about is local food. I'm a picky eater. What is um, uh, Francisco? What is my Francisco? A picky eater. I'm a picky eater. How do you say that in, in Spanish, Francisco? I'm a picky eater. Mm, I'm a picky eater. I'm a picky eater. How do you say that in Spanish, Francisco? Okay. What is that? I'm, I'm a Let picky eater. I don't know, maybe. Ah, yes, remember. A picky eater is when it, when it, when a person doesn't eat uh, all food. This person only eat some kind of food. For example, a picky eater, Francisco, is a person who, for example, you know, Francisco, I don't eat uh, fat, fat, fat uh, food, okay? For example, I don't eat, for example, uh, French fries, I don't need hamburgers, I don't need hot dogs, I only eat healthy food. Okay. Big eater is a oh, selective yeah. person, okay, who only eats, okay, it's a special kind of food, okay. Very good. Let me ask you, getting used to different culture might be difficult at first. I'd be worried about not knowing how to get around in a new city. The people that I will miss the most are my parents. We are very close. Not knowing the local customs is something I'd be concerned about. I've been nervous about getting sick and not knowing how to explain my symptoms. Communicating in a foreign language could be a challenge. Okay. For example, what about you? What about for you, um, Robert? Which of these, Robert, will be a worry for you, Robert? Mm. Which of these things will will exactly? For example, maybe you can say, okay, one thing that I will really miss is hanging out with my friends. I don't know. Let's imagine that you have the chance well, to live in, in a foreign country, no? in a foreign country, for example, I don't know, Germany, or I don't know, China, okay, Russia. Okay. With which of these uh, statements would you agree, Robert? Well, I think... Uh... Maybe, uh, let me see. Very good. Not knowing the local customs is something that I'd be concerned about. Okay, 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 okay. Very good. What about any other word? Mm. <clears throat> Maybe. Uh, well, the third one, getting used to a different culture might be difficult at first. Very good. Exactly. Exactly. I agree with you. Yes. Other one. Well, communicating in a foreign language could be a challenge. Exactly. Very good. What about you, Francisco? Let's imagine, Francisco, that you have the chance to move and live in. Um... I don't know, Francisco. Let's say Francisco in Singapore. Okay. That's right. For some reason, you have a great contract, a job contract in Singapore, Francisco. And you have to move and live there, Francisco. With which of these statements, Francisco, would you agree? Okay. Let me check. Uh... Maybe the people that I miss the most are my parents. We are very close. Very good. Okay. Uh, uh, okay. I'd be nervous about getting sick 
and no, knowing how to explain my symptoms. <laughs> my symptoms, exactly, exactly. Very good. Okay. Let's so what about this one? Something that would really be worried about is the local food. I'm a picky eater. Or maybe this one not for you, my uh, maybe it's possible, uh, because okay. I know the Singapore food is similar to Mexican food. <laughs> <laughs> okay. <laughs> have, you, have you traveled to Singapore, Mexico? Uh, no, so in the past, I, I eat the Sing Singapore food is to condiment oh, really? uh, condiment food uh, uh, okay, 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 some okay. food have uh, with chili similar no, it's okay, not a, you, you can say. equal to Mexican food but it's some dishes no okay you can, you can say eat spicy food like this. Like con, yeah. alimentos condimentados with spicy food ah yes, okay fresco fresco and um, um, okay so it's a spicy food let's go and did you enjoy the fresco or it's something that you wouldn't eat anymore. No, yes, I, I, yes, I, I, possible I eat again the Singapore food. Okay, 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 very good, excellent. Okay, so listen, I'm going to play the, the recording for that. Okay, listen, I'm going to change. Okay, and okay. The Unit 5, Expanding Your Horizons. Page 30, Exercise 1, Perspectives, Challenges of Living Abroad, Part A. Listen to people talk about moving to a foreign country. Check the concerns you think you would share. One thing that I'd really miss is hanging out with my friends. Something that I'd be worried about is the local food. I'm a picky eater. Getting used to a different culture might be difficult at first. I'd be worried about not knowing how to get around in a new city. The people that I'd miss the most are my parents. We're very close. Not knowing the local customs is something I'd be concerned about. I'd be nervous about getting sick and not knowing how to explain my symptoms. Communicating in a foreign language could be a challenge. Excellent. So I think that was really, really easy. Okay, so let, let, let's move on. Okay, very good. Okay. okay so, yeah, very good. Okay. Okay, here we have it says word power is a mixed feeling. It says these words are used to describe how people sometimes feel when they live in a foreign country, which are positive, which are negative, write P or N. For example, I will say it says anxious, comfortable, confident, curious, depressed, embarrassed, enthusiastic, excited, fascinated, homesick, insecure, nervous, uncertain uncomfortable worried for example anxious number one okay that is um, a negative feeling okay well, that is a negative feeling okay well please let's say robert what about robert comfortable positive exactly very good sorry that is a positive feeling very good okay please confident I think positive, no? Exactly, confident, confiado, con confianza, no? Very good. What about Robert? Curious. Positive, also. Positive, exactly. I will say positive. Very good. Okay, next one is super easy. I do that. That is uh, depressed. Okay, obviously it's negative. Okay. Negative. What about Francisco? Uh -huh. Embarrassed. Embarrassed, Robert. Please come. Embarrassed. Embarrassed. Do you remember what is embarrassed in Spanish? Embarrassed. Who is embarrassed in Spanish? I, I, I don't remember. 
That doesn't mean embarrassed. embarrassed. Apenado, avergonzado. Ah, negativo. Embargo. Exactly, it's negative. Good. What about uh, Robert? Enthusiastic. Enthusiastic. Enthusiastic, positive. Positive, very good. What about um, Fayesco? Excited? Positive. Positive, very good. Okay, I'll do the next one, which is fascinated. Fascinated is positive. Okay. What about, please, Robert? It says homesick. Homesick, Robert. And negative. Negative. Exactly. Exactly. Remember, remember comes is when you miss your house, you miss your activities in, in your country. Very good. Okay, Francisco, please come insecure. Negative. Negative. Very good. Okay. Well, Robert, nervous. Negative. Negative. Very good. I do the next one, uncertain, uncertain is negative, okay. Okay, Francisco, uncomfortable, uncomfortable. Negative. Negative, very good. And obviously worried, worried is obviously negative, okay. Very good, friends, okay. Okay. It says, tell your group about all the situations in which you experience the feelings in part A. What made you feel that way, okay? How do you feel about the situations now? He says, I felt embarrassed yesterday. I felt very embarrassed yesterday. I fell down the stairs in a restaurant. How did it happen? I think I slipped on something. You just a couple of, of bruises. But the restaurant manager was worried. So he convinced me to go to the hospital. Francisco, what is bruises, Francisco? Bruises. A couple of bruises. What is that, Francisco? Todo junto. Where is the first one? A couple of bruises. Just a couple of bruises. It's like a couple of bruises. I don't know. Uh, uh, that one. Uh, a couple of bruises. Un, un, un par de rasguños. Okay. Un par de, de lesiones. Okay. Very good. Oh. Okay. For example, I will tell you about one um, experience that I had in which I felt homesick, okay? For example, okay? When, as, when I finished my major in English, I, obviously, I started to work, but my first job, my first uh, formal job was at the, at, the, at the Navy, at the Mexican Navy. I used to work for the Heroic Naval Academy in Veracruz. I was a teacher there, but the hiring process was very long, so, I had a chance to visit um, in Chicago with a cousin. In the, in the meantime, they were doing all the process and I had to wait. I went to Chicago with a cousin uh, to, to live with him and to practice my English more. So I, I arrived in Chicago with him. Okay, it was um, very cold. It was in, in November, December. And I stayed there with him almost four months because the process, uh, was being slow and I didn't get the news. So I decided to stay there, there with him for four months. And obviously I spent Christmas there with him. I spent New Year Eve with him and his family, obviously. And I felt homesick there. Why? Because it was the, um, the first time that I was in another country and I was there with, with my parents and um, and the, and the weather, trust me, cold weather is not good for, for emotions, for feelings, okay? Cold weather, snow, uh, breeze, okay? Makes you feel like, like sad. So I really felt uh, homesick and also nervous because the process was slow and I believed, I believed that someday, okay, I will never be, will never be hired by the, by the Navy. In the end, after six months, okay, I was hired and I worked there for almost two years at the Navy. Very good. What are you, for you, Robert? Could you please share one experience in which you felt any of these feelings, Robert? Mm, well, I was in, 
I take a certification. I took a certification in Europe, in Czech Republic, yeah, about oh, really? 10 years ago. Yeah, about really? 10 years ago. It was a two months certification, not very much time, but I think it was a good experience because I had the opportunity to to see how this uh, supposedly socialist countries live because they were oh. part of the community of the Soviet Union. Uh, uh, oh, well, okay. It was no longer Soviet Union, but ex-Soviet Union uh, alliance. Okay. And I thought it was a good experience because um, the, the city is a very small city. I think uh, okay. cities in, 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 well, in that country, there were very small, nothing to compare with the Mexico City, for example. Population is very few. And okay. for example, the, the public uh, transportation is very accessible. Uh, it's not very crowded. And they don't know about the all the uh, the vendors that are on the streets. Okay, okay. The okay, city okay. is more or less clean. I think it's cleaner than the downtown in Mexico City. I think. <laughs> and, <laughs> okay. Well, I don't uh, speak uh, Czech, obviously, and they okay. don't speak. Uh, not Spanish, not English. Uh, so I was uh, trying to communicate by uh, signs or by maybe by the small uh, English or the few English that I could uh, speak to everyone. But they they are very friendly. They don't. Okay, 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 okay. Yeah, they are very friendly. And something that is very noticeable is that there are not many children there uh, most of the people are adults or and older people i think so they oh, don't have uh, really? they don't have uh, too much children in fact uh, i was uh, amazed that, that would be the the word okay. when i see that uh, many buildings are very old and they are not painted because nobody lives here there oh, okay 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 that is that is shocking no no really because i mean imagine okay so it, it's, it's a country and so as far as i understand robert it, it's a country of uh, all people yes yes they are as i understood they always uh, be considered as a satellite of, of russia and they are neighbors ah. of, of ukraine i remember that they were afraid of, of the war in ukraine for that time 10 years ago they say ukraine oh, okay. is uh, 100 kilometers from here from the uh, what was the name of the the city it, it was not the prague because prague is the most famous ah, no, 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 no. No, it's the like, capital yeah. of the Czech Republic, but there is another uh, city. I was in another mean? city that is very close to the frontier with uh, Ukraine, and, oh, and from that okay, time okay. they were they were afraid for, from the a possible war in Ukraine ten years ago. Oh, oh. oh imagine the, the, the distance were the distance was for like uh, from going to Mexico to. Toluca city, that was the distance from exactly. Ukraine. Very close, <laughs> very close, Robert. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. Okay. No, imagine, Robert, imagine nowadays, no, the, the long war between Russia and Ukraine and that country there, Robert, very close. No, Robert, that is a nightmare, yes. okay? <laughs> very good. Robert, and how long did you stay there? A year? Only two months. It was Only just a, ah, a okay, okay. from 
for attending the certification. Okay, okay. I, don't, I'm, so in my opinion, like... I think it was a good experience. I achieved the certification and it was a, a good experience, but uh, I didn't learn any word in, in Czech. <laughs> it was very <laughs> difficult. <laughs> No, 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 and I, and I thought it wasn't worth to try, even try because uh, only two months, so I, I don't need this uh, this language. <laughs> okay, <laughs> come on, Robert. very good, excellent, very good. Okay, that's a good experience, Robert. Okay, what about you, Francisco? Can you please tell us a, a, an experience, okay, in which you, Francisco, felt any any of these feelings Francisco? in any any context Francisco? okay maybe <clears throat> one time once once that you felt i don't know enthusiastic or that you felt i don't know uh uncertain or insecure i don't know yeah i remember uh when i uh, finish finish it the the ah yeah I forget it. how did you say the end of the in nineteen ninety nine when passed the the ah the one century. year to other chief yeah the century yes ah yeah I the was excited or because the I, I, I mean, yes, yes, yes. yeah I was excited because my I, I had a I was a good friend. He invited me to visit to Washington D.C. for passing this okay. this this time or this times or this parties in in the Washington uh -huh. D.C. And I remember when when they celebrating the between novelists and the. You know, if you remember, did you see the picture with the Tom Hanks in the forest gone? They yes. visited the, this place. A, a lo, a, all people concentrate in this place for pre, for present say this celebration. And in this celebration right. with the, I remember was the Clinton, Clinton president in this time. Yes. And they be, and they invited to the Bono Bono from the YouTube. Um, yes, 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 the, the singer. Also, huh? yeah, the singer also stayed the, the this men blogging the the picture. This is this actor. Ah, yes, the I men in black. I don't remember his, his name. Yes, 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 yes. Very good. Yes, yes. Okay, so. Uh, I remember the I married. I had two more or less uh, two years. Okay. Two okay. years. Uh, two years ago, married with my wife, and also he visited with me in this travel, okay. in this trip. So okay. we concentrated in this place. So I remember the the call is too hard. No. The weather was the very cold. Very cold, yes, because it's in the in the early in the middle in the midnight. Passed no the okay. the nineteen ninety nine yes. to two thousand in the midnight at in the early in the early morning. After that, uh, we yes. need to walk. Uh, from this place to the friend's house, I remember in my oh, whole body. Really? Yes, walking, because really? uh, the public transportation or the taxes or the other is not a because the there are a, a lot of people in the places you need to you need to walk, no. <laughs> okay, so okay, okay, okay. I remember the. Uh, I I felt in my body with a uh, running water, no, <laughs> in my exactly. 
because the the weather is too hard no? or or the temperature uh, is is down no i i i don't remember or mm. less what the 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 weather or the temperature at this moment but i feel very hard my body and i feel okay. running water from my skin no <clears throat> But that really was okay, a, okay, a okay. great experience, honestly. I I I remember the teenagers they uh, access to the you know because there are a, a long a long water between Novelis and and White House. There is a I don't know is a how do you say Fuente? Ah yes, look at this. I'm going to put it there. There is um, a fountain, fountain, maybe. Fountain, fountain. Yeah, fountain is a fountain. big fountain. The teenagers oh, right, access right. to the fountain are at uh, in this moment. I don't know. Oh. They support they this went, water at this. They went in, in into the fountain, my school. Yes, the the, the teenagers. Uh, oh, oh, come on. Yeah, <laughs> but you know they. They more or less drink, drink the whiskey that I see the, the a little, uh, the, I don't know, a sky jacket, no, the, a little bottles. They have yes. the, the whiskey and they are more or less drunk, drunk. And for, maybe for <laughs> the reason they have a, uh, <laughs> They, the energy they, and the power, no? Yeah. But uh, honestly, it was a, a great experience. Uh, it, it was exciting for me. I Because in this travel also, um, we visited more 12, 12 cities into the, into the USA. Um, okay, okay. Because travel from from uh, Washington DC to Chicago. And yes. in this travel, uh, I stopped in different places, no? Uh, okay. For example, in, Cle in Cleveland, we passed the nativity with the parents, okay, okay. with the wife, with the friend's wife, wife party, parents. Very good. Okay, uh, yeah, and also from the Cleveland, go to the in the car, tra traveling from from Cleveland to Chicago, and in All the right. the happy the New Year passed in in Peoria, Chicago also. So it was a oh. excited uh, travel. Really, very good. It, 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 it was a It was an exciting. It was an exciting journey. Yes, it was, it was an, an exciting, exciting journey. journey. Okay, Francisco. But Francisco, Chicago and all those cities are very cold, Francisco. No, I stay there. In yes, this I animation. remember the Oh come on! His name is Alfred, and I I talk I talk Alfred Alfred. How? How can you? How can you put up with this cold? How can you put up with this cold? Okay, you may put put up with put up with this tolerate. Okay, how can you tolerate this cold? Well, the project was was horrible. I mean, this this um, lake in Mich in the Chicago Lake, these like frozen, yeah. frozen over. Yes, mm -hmm. it's beautiful. This, 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 this view, the, 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 the fathers, the fathers, the, the father's wife, the father's, uh, the father's wife from my friend. Okay. Uh, they have a, 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 a beautiful house close to the lake and what we arrive we yeah, we we arrive at this place and this place is um this house had two two or three levels 
Pero in, in the... In the... Stay... Stay... Stay work Stay... The... The stay work Have the view to the lake. And you see the I, lake for the window. Or the big window. Yeah. And the lake yeah. all... All cold. All... Frozen. Yeah, all frozen. frozen. What's a beautiful all view. Frozen. Yes. <laughs> oh, qué bárbaro. Let's go. Let's go. Uh, well, maybe the view is beautiful, so, but, but I didn't like the weather. It's terribly hot. I say, I say, Alfred, how, how can you live here and go, go back to Mexico with me? Okay, and, and but no, <laughs> he's still living there. <laughs> but no, <laughs> he's still li living there in, in Chicago, and he's a, a lorry driver. And even even in the, in that weather, like snow weather or weather storms, he drive his his lorry. He has been living there for almost. 30 years, but and he told me, Miguel, don't go back to Mexico, stay here in Chicago with me. If you will speak English well, you can get a good job. Um, but no, I, I didn't like it. No, when I didn't like the, the American lifestyle, <laughs> and number two, I didn't like the, the weather, the weather is extreme, okay. And and I talking, yeah, Alfred, obviously, you, you, you make dollars, no, you earn dollars, okay. But also, I produce yeah. ten dollars. So, uh, so what's the point? Maybe the good idea is to make dollars, to earn dollars, and to spend pesos in Mexico. No, oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Yes. Nice. okay. Exactly, exactly. And what, what, what about you, Robert? If you had a chance to live in the USA, Robert, will you accept it, Robert, or will you quit it? No. I, I couldn't accept it. In fact, I, I remember that I was, uh, when I was studying, maybe eventually will work in, in, in US. And I, uh, how can I say, and I can achieve, uh, I can, I could afford uh, the visa. And I have the visa for 10 years. Ah. And I never went to, to US. Because another <laughs> opportunity is, uh, no, I, I never use it. So the visa expired and I never renew it and I don't care because uh, in, the, in the meantime, uh, many opportunities uh, uh, arose and I went to, twice to Europe, once to oh, the, okay, okay, this okay. Uh, certification and the second one in, to Germany. So when I oh, visited, okay. for example, Germany, in, uh, the Berlin, this city, I was uh, totally surprised because it's another world. It's another different. Uh, they call Germany. Uh, it? Well, it's a beautiful city, of course, but they call Germany. How could I say the motor? Well, the motor is the motor of Europe. So there are plenty oh, okay, of okay, companies. Okay. There are plenty of opportunities. Uh, okay, they speak okay. English uh, very well. We, I noticed that you go to in the subway and you see, for, for example, these little shops when they send the, the newspaper of candies and the, the people who are attending the, this kind of a, a business, small business, they speak English very well. And I was surprised. <laughs> so you go to ah. you go walking and... You, and you find ordinary people like that, they speak English. I was so surprised when they not only speak German, but they, they speak English in a very normal, Friendly. regular way. Yes, but very funny. Right. And I saw that okay. the, 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 they demand a lot of uh, high skill people, immigrants. Okay, 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 so okay, okay, it's, okay. it's very, uh, I think it's easier to go to work to Germany, for example, than going to the US. Uh, it's, okay, so I, okay. I forgot everything about the US. <laughs> and I started <laughs> uh, Robert, uh, uh, going. Robert, and um, what about the cost of living in Germany? I think Germany is, a, is, a, is an expensive country to live in. Yeah, I mean, renting a house there, expensive. renting an apartment, or buying food i don't know i never been there but i suspect that it's expensive to live there yes yes it's expensive 
I remember the, in fact, the, the euro is uh, more or less the same as uh, um, having your salary in US dollar. It's more or less the same, but everything more is like. too expensive. I remember, remember that if you go to the bathroom, you are on the street and maybe you need to go to the bathroom, paying for bathroom in yes. any place, in any business is one euro. It was, I, I remember at that time it was about uh, 15 pesos, more or less. Yeah. So I said, oh, okay. how come if you go to Tianguis and maybe you go to the bar by five pesos? Oh, now, Robert, now it's 20, almost 22 pesos. No, imagine, Robert, me, that in, in yes. cold weather, in, in cold weather, I, I become a peer. Imagine I will spend all my salary paying for for going to the bar. <laughs> oh, come on, yeah. Robert! No, it's expensive. That is expensive, Robert. Okay. Yeah. Imagine. Oh no, poor, poor, imagine, poor, poor myself. Okay, investing all, all my money on going to the bar. Okay. <laughs> Okay, okay. No, uh, Robert, that is differently from Cuba. Um, as you know, my my parents were born in Cuba. I was born in in, in Veracruz, but my parents were born in Cuba. And in Cuba, when you visit Cuba, uh, Robert, and if you are on the streets, obviously if you want to. I don't know if you have a, a special need okay, to go to the toilet. Okay, at least for pee. Okay, and there are no toilets, uh, no available toilets there. I know you, so you have to pay, no? but if there aren't any toilet, any available toilet around, no problem. You can pee on a tree or you can pee on the streets. And police won't <laughs> stop you, won't stop you because they know that there, there aren't <laughs> available toilets around. Okay, so um, it, it, it's uh, allowed to pee on the streets or to pee on, on, on a tree. Okay? <laughs> but imagine in Germany, no. <laughs> no, you can do that. <laughs> Oh, come on, Robert. <laughs> That's too bad, Robert. <laughs> okay, okay. Yeah. And what are you, Francesco? You had a chance to, to live in the USA, Francesco. Would you live there, Francesco? Would you accept the, the opportunity, Francesco? No, really, no. I oh, only no, I like for visit, but no, because the, um, I don't know, it's a, uh, uh, I it's, it's a country the racing the racist country. Uh, How do you say yeah. the yes, uh -huh. yes discrimination? It's not a uh, no. yeah. When I visit the for so it was a surprise for me because in in Washington D.C. when I you visit the museums uh, or another uh, places. There are a lot of people from different countries. No, I I found the people from from Spain, from Asia, from India. It's is a country with a lot with the different cultures. No. All right. Okay. Uh, yeah. So, but uh, I remember when I when I visited for first time the USA. Yes, I I told no yes i go i go to the usa i live in i want to live in usa because i see the you know uh maybe see the the great opportunities or or maybe a possibility for have a better live or 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 other benefits I mean, so I mean, I mean, I mean, my life. friend yes a better life maybe than mexico but no no and and I remember the my friend comment me uh, it's not too easy, my friend, because when you come to USA, yes, if you come as engineer or or with a a career, uh, and recon, it's difficult to recognize in USA from Mexico if you can recognize your your grade, no. So you need to huh? your profession, yes. And it's not a good idea going to for worrying as a, I don't know, maybe because in the restaurants, for example, the Latin people is uh, 
clean de, de, de tables or, or patrons, de, this kind of or, or possibilities is for the Latin people in, in the major option. No? Is my friend, it's not a good idea come to for with your career to come to USA uh, stay with this opportunity. It's not an opportunity, no, for you. So now okay, okay, okay. is really for uh, this kind of jobs as Deloitte, for example, I don't need to I don't need to live in USA for have a good opportunity or, or a better options because with this kind of jobs or opportunities, you have a good job and no need to let your country, no? I, exactly. at this moment, I, I never let my country now because I love my country. So we have a lot of things here. Yes, I, I like to visit. Yes, I, I love to travel for only visit at, at tourists, but uh, I love Mexico. <laughs> Excellent, and, very good. And, and let's live in, in USA because the people is cold. Uh, and Mexico is uh, more friendly, you know? The people is more, more, uh, more friendly, you no? Know? Exactly, exactly. Yes, exactly, true. Exactly, yes. Uh, uh, exactly, I agree with you, okay? I, I didn't also like that, okay? Racism from the US, okay? That is just very, very crazy, okay? Okay, I mean, okay, before before we go, let, let's continue with this, okay? Look at this. I'm going to share my screen with you, and let's go to the board, okay? Here at the board, okay, the grammar for this unit five is this one, okay? So the grammar focus, it says noun phrase containing relative clauses. For example, look, look, at, look at the beginning of the sentence it says something that i would be worried about is the local food one thing that i really miss is hanging out with my friends the people who or the people that i will miss the most are my parents or you can say the local food is something that i would be worried about hanging out with my friends is one thing i would really miss my parents are the people who or that I will miss the most. So you can use the, the noun phrases at the beginning. Look at this, okay? Obviously, this is the noun phrase. Something that, okay? One thing that, and the people who, the people that, okay? You can use them at the beginning or at the end. Is something that I will be worried about. Is one thing I will really miss. Or the people who or that I will miss the most, okay? Here, I also wrote this, okay, for example. Look at this here, okay. Now, friends, with that, for example, anything that, example, anything that glitters is not gold. Everything that, everything that she said was true. The thing that, the thing that bothers me is the noise. Something that, I found something that belongs to you. The idea that, the idea that can change the world is inspiring. Or the fact that the fact that he won't surprise everyone. Okay. Or also other variations. For example, the people that or the people who live here are friendly. Something important that something important that you should know is that headlines, that deadlines are approaching. The moment that the moment that change, everything was unexpected. A place where a place where you can relax is essential for mental health. Okay. For example, this obviously here we have the basic one, which are from the book. It says something, remember, you can say something that one thing that or the people who or any of this one. Okay, so I'm going to share this with you, okay, on the cloud. So you can also have it anyway. Okay, give me, give me a minute, okay? Very good. I'm going to overload them to the cloud. Very good. Give me a second. Very good. There I go. Okay, there you go, okay. Very good. Okay. There you go, okay. Very good. Let me let me put it there, okay. Okay. Very good. Okay, 
There it goes. And nobody went. Ah, there it is. It was too big. Okay. Tiny goes me. It's a phrase that's good. Okay. And it's going to be here in the cloud. Okay. Okay, it's here. Very good. Tiny goes. Okay. Good, 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 there goes. Okay. Good. Okay. Okay, good, 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 good. There it goes. Okay. Okay, I'm going to set the link there. Okay, on on the meet. Okay, on the meet chat. Okay, and then you will find these phrases. Okay, if you click on the link, okay, you will be able to see these examples. Okay, look at this. This one. Okay, it says non phrases with that and other variations. Okay. For example, for example, uh, let's practice them verbally. Okay. Let's not worry, let's practice verbally. For example, for example, if I, let's imagine that I accepted the, my coach's invitations to, to stay and live and, and work in Chicago with him, something that I will be worried about is, um, is uh, I don't know, the, the losing of my Mexican identity, okay? Something that I will be worried about is the losing, okay, of my Mexican identity, or the losing of my Mexican identity is something that I would be worried about, okay. Or one thing, if I if I had stayed there with him, one thing that I would really miss, okay, is obviously um, going out, going out with my friends and my cousins. Or going out with my friends and my cousins is one thing that I would really miss. Okay. Okay. What about you, Robert? Could you please tell me one example, Robert, using any of these ones? Something that, one thing that, or the people that. Let's imagine, Robert, that you decide to move and, and live in Germany. Okay. Let's imagine that the hypothetical situation, Robert. What is something that you will miss that you? Will really okay miss or worried about? <clears throat> well, I think the people that I miss the most are my parents, and but, the local food is something that I really worry about. <clears throat> <laughs> okay, okay, very good. Okay, <laughs> what about Robert? Sorry, Francisco, Francisco. Let's imagine, Francisco, that you, for some reason, Francisco, you decide to move and live in the U.S. That's okay. Let's think about that hypothetical situation. What is something that you will be worried about? What is one thing you will really miss, Francisco? Ah, uh, in the first time, the food. Because the, food. the, US, the USA food is very worried. The, the, be worried the, about is the local food. No? Okay. So okay. also, yeah, the uh, I really miss I hanging out with my friends also, and okay. also with visit my parents. No. Exactly. Exactly. Very good. Excellent. Very good. Yes. Okay. So just have more five minutes for the class to finish. Okay. Let's practice a conversation. What about let's say. Robert, so Robert, please tell Robert, what is your day going to be like today, Robert? Uh, what I'm doing today, You're, you mean? Exactly, what, what is your day going to be like today, exactly, yes. Well, I think to attend some calls here in the in my project and to finish uh, 
many courses <laughs> because we have a lot of courses to finish by middle of december so right. we have we have one month no less than one month to finish all the courses and to attend okay, the exams okay. and well i think it's going to be very heavy but hopefully by six or five will be finished the office hours all right all right okay all right how many courses are you going to take well i have to final uh, finalize one course and maybe exams in december is that 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 one certification is the python certification and the other one is uh, the industry certification i think i have the 50 percent of progress in this but i have another one that i have to take by next week and it's to to complete it to full days and there is okay. a waiting list for this course and the thing is that if you uh, cancel your enrollment you have to pay a fee I, i'm reading that you have to pay a fee so i that's what i i i feel oh. a, a compromise to attend this course so okay. three okay. three long courses certifications Okay, I have the commitment. I have the commitment. Okay, to finish. Yeah. The courses. Okay. Yes, because once you are in, engaged, you cannot roll off. Oh, so, so Robert, besides the English course here with me, you also take another extra course at the company. Yes, and also the daily activities in the project. Oh, okay, 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 Robert. Oh, and, and Robert, so that is English 3. And is that easy, Robert, for you, or is it difficult for you? Well, I think uh, understanding and when you are in the meetings and are listening is easier. All right. All right. Yeah, I think the, the more complex is the fluency when you have to okay. participate in the, in the meetings. But uh, when you are listening, when they are saying and the point that they are in, in discussion, you get the idea that you can take notes. Uh, okay, 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 okay. You okay, follow okay. the conversation, but uh, when you are when in your turn to participate and you maybe contribute with some ideas, maybe that's the part, difficult part. Okay. Okay, okay. So, Robert, if you don't take the courses, you have to pay a fee for that? Well, in the other courses, no, but this is the first time that I see this oh. uh, regulation, what I would say. Yes, this, yes, yes. But this is yes. a different course. And it says, because, maybe it's because there's a waiting list. So they ah, don't want okay, to. Okay, okay, okay. Some people. Uh, take the places and other people cannot enroll and at the end they just don't take the course so maybe that's why they are finding the the people who don't attend all right all right very good okay so it's going to be a busy day okay what are you fresco what is your day going to be like today fresco um will be a a normal day uh, right. with courses and some meetings but okay, okay. good um you know the normal day with activities commonly okay. i will have for every day <laughs> very good but how many courses will you take today uh continues with uh because the courses really is, is too large so too long the too last long. week yeah, finish it too long okay este the for the for the firewall 
administration, but I started with the um, activity, uh, the new courses for the cloud services All in right. the Amazon services. And ah, we have okay, to, okay, okay. for this, for this kind of course, I need to take more three courses. But uh, these courses have several modules, modules and okay. you need to practice and apply the labs, no, the laboratories for understand yes, better yes. The, the courses. And when you do the laboratories, you need to invest in invest more time for develop these laboratories. No, for this reason, the courses, because if only you take only see the courses uh, yes, yes. online is not a good idea because you don't practice and in in our in, in our um, profession you need to practice for understand better for when you will be assigned to the project uh, you you need to do the activities in the real life yes, exactly. <laughs> situations okay. yes that is like really practicing okay Okay, okay, very good, very good. Okay, my friends, so thank you very much for being here today. Thank you, Francisco. thank you, Robert. Okay, have a great day, okay? Enjoy your day. I'll see you in the class. Thank you very much, my friends. Thank you, take care. Thank you. Bye-bye. Take thank care, you, Michael. Good day. Bye-bye. Thank, thank, thank you. Good day. Thank you. Good day. Thank you.